Welcome to hopefully a bit of street skateboarding today. We are in Carrollton, which is basically like the Korea town-ish Asian town of the DFW area. We're at this school, which I thought was gonna be closed, but look at all these cars around. There's a security van, but I don't think anyone's in it. But I think I have found a spot, and I actually found this using an app. The stair set's a little too long to jump down. You can maybe skate this kind of like a manual pad, but that's really rough, and there's like cracks kind of everywhere. So this is kind of like a looks are deceiving. So right here we have a decent five stair, and then right here we have not a super decent three stair. The handrail is definitely possible though. It's a little tall, but I think we can make this, make this work. So the thing I want to skate is this handrail behind me, but it's really tall. My ollies do feel kind of solid right now, but it's against the wind, unfortunately, and wind can really throw you off. But it is tall and you can sack, but it's not really long enough to be super effective in the sacking domain. So I'm at least going to throw around a board side, probably a front board, just see how it feels. texted Dale and was like, what's a good LA skate spot app? And he's like, this one. And it has spots like everywhere, all over the country. So now I can see all the random things here. Like this bank looks amazing. I feel like we should just go over there. Fun, mellow bank. Kind of looks like a manual pad, but this one looks, this one looks solid. It's Saturday though and not Sunday. So some things are actually still open. Kent Elementary School. I kind of want to check this out. I don't know if these ledges are skatable, but just the fact that it's covered, I feel like it'll protect us from the wind, which is kind of the goal we're going for. Ah, oh, this manual pad looks actually good huh this is where we are right now decent but uh yeah this is pretty cool let's go whoa let's check out kent elementary 12 minutes away whatever let's go over there uh that's kind of where i was gonna hang out today anyway so we're good what that was just totally intuitive to try and it <laughs> i actually did it all right watch this Eh, I could be better. Oh, pretty good. That was easier. I never feel cool doing wall ride tricks, but I feel like I should figure out some combination, like a Wally Nolly. I've actually never done that one. People do it, so maybe this is the wall I learned it on. Is that kind of it? Oh, that was way better. Okay, that's how you're supposed to do it. Wow. Maybe I'm getting cocky. But now I feel like I can do a fakie, and I kind of want to try like nollie half cab out. I kind of want to try shove out. Okay. That's enough wall riding. My board can't take any more of the chipping. So let's go look at this elementary school and see if it has ledges and hope that it's not open. Unfortunately, I think they got the memo uh, on all of them. They have these like screws built in to stop the skateboarding from happening. I'm also just realizing that I'm missing the grand opening of the Dickey Skate Park event. Yes, I've made a bunch of videos about it already but a lot of pro skateboarders from there came and I know that would be interesting content. So part of me is a bit anxious now cause I'm like, damn, I missed the thing, this thing that I was kind of planning for a bit and now I don't get to make a video out of it. But in the future, I'll be able to make videos with anybody who's involved with the project anyways. But still, I was like, oh, people liked my last Dickies video. I feel like they would really like that. But now I'm just like, 
it's a little too late to make it over there. I do like being out in the sun. It is very bright and nice. And we have found this thing, which kind of looks like a manual pad and you can treat it as such. But since there's such a hole at the top, if you clip that and you go spiraling down this, it's gonna hurt. So it might be better just to skate it in different ways. Like kind of skate it manual sideways or like ollie up flip trick. And it's windy, but this is so low key and low to the ground that it's not, you know, we're gonna be fine. I don't know what's going on with these movers behind me in this truck. But they were like in the back of nowhere and they seem very not into me being here. So I don't know what that means. I don't know if they're hiding something or what, but I feel sketched out. I'm here by myself, so I'm probably gonna dip out. We're not getting even close to as much skateboarding as I would like to get today. And honestly, we're wasting a lot of time. I'm still a little anxious that I missed the whole freaking Dickies opening thing. That kind of sucks ass, uh, but I might just end up going to skate a park because of the, the wind situation. It's really unfortunate finding spots in it being too windy to skate. So to me, I'm like, you know what? If it's gonna be this bad, and it's gonna be this bad all day, according to the weather, it's basically like a windstorm all day, then I might as well just go to a skate park and, and suffer there, rather than suffering in the streets where you need like all the elements to be on your side. The trick goes kind of blind and I land Primo obviously a lot. So to learn the trick down something, I'm probably gonna get Primo a few times. So I have to like flesh out the three stair before I actually try to do it down like a six stair. That's gonna hurt me. But I kind of want to try fakie inward heel switch manual on this. Maybe the fakie manual. Cause I feel like it's just as easy doing it up a curve than it is on flat. When it's windy, you just can't do new tricks. I'm just gonna set up the camera and tinker to see if anything just comes to me naturally. I am currently burning out and I hate when YouTubers talk about this. That's why this is on my second channel. I'm not gonna make a whole video about it because blah, 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 blah. But I can feel this huge, I'm, you know, I've been making four videos a week, three shorts a week, lots of content. And I can feel like myself kind of in this uh, Groundhog Day, but I know it's gonna change. So that's why I'm just grinding through this moment right now. But like it paralyzes me. Sometimes I sit here like this and I'm like, and I just, I literally move like this to do the next thing I'm like, cause like, I'll still do it. Like I'm still gonna do my job. I'm still gonna go home, edit, do everything, but I move like in slow motion and it still gets done. But by the time I'm done, I feel like sick. Cause I'm just like, if you push through a burnout too hard, it makes you feel like really nauseous, at least for me. And that's what I'm doing right now. But just thought I would share a personal antidote. If you don't mind, this is kind of like my podcast segment is me talking at the end of these progress daily videos, but I think in a month or so, you know, life is always gonna be stressful and I'm gonna always be stacking on top and top and top. I'm going into super work mode right now, but yeah, I, I, I feel a lot of weight right now and it's just, it's just like the, you know, anxiety of things to come, but it's fine. 
everything right now is good i'm skating i'm having fun and tomorrow i'm actually going on this like skate adventure so i'm actually really stoked on that i'm filming the video so stay tuned for my channel john hill if you want to see a video about a skate park that's like two hours away it's ridiculous the story is amazing like it's 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 gonna be a great video so stay tuned for that and thank you for hopefully you enjoyed this video a little bit but it was uh it was a tough one. It was, we grinded today, but I'm going to feel productive. I'm so glad we did this and uh, I'll see you next time. Every Tuesday and Thursday on my channel, every Monday and Wednesday on this channel. I don't know if I should include all this. I'm just talking on my ass, but hope you enjoyed. Hope you don't mind a little personal antidote. Thank you so much. Take care. Progress daily and keep killing it.